Hello, I would like to tell you about Raphael Lemkin, who was a professor of law at Rutgers School of Law in Newark, and campaigned for international laws defining and forbidding genocide. In 1943 Lemkin wrote, Generally speaking, genocide does not necessarily mean the immediate destruction of a nation, except when accomplished by mass killings of all members of a nation. It is intended rather to signify a coordinated plan of different actions aiming at the destruction of essential foundations of the life of national groups, with the aim of annihilating the groups themselves. The objectives of such a plan would be the disintegration of the political and social institutions, of culture, language, national feelings, religion, and the economic existence of national groups, and the destruction of the personal security, liberty, health, dignity, and even the lives of the individuals belonging to such groups. The Convention on the Prevention and Punishment of the Crime of Genocide was adopted by the United Nations General Assembly on 9 December 1948 as General Assembly Resolution 260. It defines genocide in legal terms, and quite a number of countries have agreed to the terms of this resolution, so even though you might personally have a different idea of what genocide is, the legal definition is already defined. Many people are under the impression that genocide must be violent and include mass murder, but that is not correct. Here is the exact resolution terms. Article 2 of the Convention defines genocide as any of the following acts committed with intent to destroy, in whole or in part, a national, ethnical, racial or religious group, as such, killing members of the group, causing serious bodily or mental harm to members of the group, deliberately inflicting on the group conditions of life calculated to bring about its physical destruction in whole or in part, imposing measures intended to prevent births within the group, forcibly transferring children of the group to another group. Article 3 defines the crimes that can be punished under the Convention, genocide, conspiracy to commit genocide, direct and public incitement to commit genocide, attempt to commit genocide, complicity in genocide, 